Every day the rider ventures out to deliver multiple shipments. Each of these shipments having a specific time slot requested by the customer. Delivering these shipments on time is not at all easy. When we designed the map overview feature of Locus for Locus on the road, our priority was to make the life of the rider easier by showing the entire day's, an entire day's work on an entire map view. Uh, to segregate each of these slots and also show a clear definition of the statuses was a, it was a challenge. The delivery location and sequence was not enough for populating that map view. We realized that we need to show a clear differentiation between each of the slots that the rider needs to cater to and also deliver them on time. And that's where we put our thinking caps on. Because at this point, we already had five distinct colors which represented in our map view. Some things were queued, completed, cancelled, a breach in SLA and also ongoing. To add more colors into this entire map view would have been a cognitive overload for the rider and would have complicated the entire application. We put ourselves in the rider's shoes and we asked ourselves, what is going to make my life easier or what is the least overwhelming way that I can view colors on the phone to make, make sure that I deliver on time and I deliver efficiently. Right? Uh, that's when inspiration struck. We were studying multiple map views of subway systems of various cities. We were seeing how the subway system and the, the colors of the subway system is representing a certain set of information and conveying a certain set of information. We decided that a specific color would pertain to a specific slot and have only a set of specific colors. We didn't stop there. We also took into account uh, riders or, or personnel with color blindness. So we had specific uh, polygon shaped and specific shapes of these uh, tasks on the map view which would convey certain information. We also addressed multiple challenges at this point. What if there are multiple markers in the same location? What if it's a sunny day? And what happens? So we address this by clustering each of these markers and having them as a, uh, as a special clustered icon. Making sure the present colors that we have or these fixed colors that we have are okay to be seen at, at a full day's brightness. Right? These are multiple on-ground challenges that we addressed. We built the entire color-based map view keeping the rider in mind. We had to understand what is happening on ground, how he reacts on his day. Not only us, our, our, all our teams had to understand because we all were included in the development, right? Our engineering teams, our designing teams, our product teams, everyone had to make sure that we understand what the rider faces on ground when he has so much of cognitive overload in terms of colors, in terms of the sunlight, his external environments, along with the exact time slot that he needs to arrive on time. Our goal is to empower the riders to streamline the entire work they do that they do every day and our job is to make their lives easier.